welcome to Mel Mondays, episode 114. Today we have 11 packages, mostly uh, packages that my queen wife likes to open, only four. Well, I guess it's about half and half almost, but either way, more of your stuff than last time when it was all just boxes. Yeah. And more of your stuff. Yeah, this one's on my level. Yeah. So click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. And let's get into Mail Monday's episode 114. You're up. Me, little me. Little juice. This one feels like cute or something. Okay. Maybe not. Might be too square. Well, dang. Another one. Ooh. Ooh. Nice way to start. Alright. Arinti. Arinti? Yeah, they've sent us a few different products. Yes. So they have a PTZ outdoor solar powered camera. Oh yeah, they sent us the dog treat one. They did, yeah. Yeah, our uh, shooting dog treat camera thingy. Yeah. For those annoying dogs that are barking now because we started recording. Yep. Um, was sent it's by them. Time. Yeah. They just know. I swear. I'm they surprised they didn't start as soon as I hit the button. Because that's normally how it goes. Good, good. Okay, so that's a good outdoor camera, solar power. Yeah, yeah, I like it. All right, uh, I'm gonna save this for you because I swear like clothes. this feels like clothes, and I don't remember like approving any clothes, but this box. All right, this one. A new tripod. This tripod is actually really cool though because it has a uh, MagSafe connector for iPhones on it. So instead of having to actually like use a clip to mount your phone, you're able to just bam, magnetically connect it to this tripod and boom, you're able to record. So depending on the height, this may become my new tripod because it'd just be easier to deal with. Yeah. <laughs> Been waiting on this for like two or three months. Was they were making it and had to get it in stock. And so a new magnetic yeah. tripod. Good start. Yeah. Alright, let's see if this is clays. It really feels like it's not. I don't know what it is. Oh, please. I think it's a few clays. Oh, Firebox. Firebox. That's They're for you. Shirt, shirt. Totally shirt. forgot about these coming. Shirt. Four shirts for the king. Yeah, I totally forgot about Blank. these. I'm sorry. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, Firebox. Uh, I did like two videos for them before. I did a winter one and uh, they made some great jeans. Oh, they fit they great. Yeah. And this is like the new summer collection. So I told them, heck yeah, send me some stuff. I'd make some videos. And uh, that's, that's what that is. New Firebox clothes. All right. Two V necks, two crew necks. It looks like yeah. nice. You got to get rid of some shirts. You're out of rent. Yeah. Handy dandy. It actually is. So this is a magnetic, is it the right way? Yeah. A magnetic uh, LED light. So it's got magnets on it. And like say your hood's up and you're working on your car, you're able to just have this charged up and boom, magnetize it to your hood and you can see inside your car. I thought it was actually pretty cool. So yeah. Told them I'd make them an Amazon video because that's what they wanted. So this would be coming sick. Work like Okay. The easy kind. <laughs> I lied. <laughs> hey, we haven't seen that in a while. I know. It's been a minute. And this is, oh, it was right side up. It looked upside down. Oh, adapter? Nice. Wi Fi 6 USB adapter. The fudge is a Wi Fi 6. So, ironically enough, the Wise camera Thank that you. came today is a Wi Fi 6 camera. It's just a faster speed. Remember, I upgraded our Wi Fi to Wi Fi 6? Cat 6. So, Cat 6 is the cable. Yeah. That's what we put under the house, right? Yeah, that's Cat 6. That's a that's a cable. Wi-Fi 6 is, it's just more bands and wider bandwidth, faster Wi-Fi technology. So like old Wi-Fi was 2.4 gigahertz and then they came out with 5 gigahertz and then they came out with Wi-Fi 6 and now they came out with Wi-Fi 6E. Our routers are Wi-Fi 6E, so we're like future-proof until they come out with Wi-Fi 7. <laughs> Or eight, whatever's next. I don't know what's next, but yeah. Does that mean after a new one comes out, you gotta buy a new? Or are you just slower than everyone else? Uh, what do you mean? Like when they get to Wi Fi 7, do we have to buy new routers? No. Oh. no. Okay, good. Most of our devices don't even support Wi Fi 6. The MacBook does, my phone does, your phone doesn't, the newest iPhone does. Why would your phone do it and mine doesn't? 
this is a Google Pixel, so put it on there. The iPhone didn't put it on their phone, so I think this very last one, the 15. And why don't I have a new... I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now that we've had a technology Wi-Fi learning lesson, let's uh, see what this big box is. Close for me. Wow. That's heavy duty. Yeah, I knew these were coming, but man, I didn't know they were this big. Very heavy duty. Um, okay. Well... <gasps> Break down. So, this is a solar LED wall light. Normally, these are a lot smaller. They're, you know, like this size. But uh, I must not have realized that these are like massive. Like, where, oh, no. where are we going to put this now? That we means could, each one is like five pounds. We could put it over our artboard and have like a super bright light when we pull in the yard. Our neighbors already probably hate us with all the lights. <laughs> they only cut on if you walk in our yard, so. <laughs> yeah, so. Uh, How do you know it's solar? Does it say solar? It doesn't, but I'm pretty certain it is. Like, I normally don't get lights that aren't solar. Hmm. There's a sticker. LED. Well, now I don't know. Hmm. So maybe. Maybe not. Yeah. I'm not fully certain. They were supposed to be solar, I believe, but yeah. Now it's I just don't not know. an obvious thing as it is. Yeah. All right, wow. That I don't want one. either of these. I already know who they are. I saw <laughs> the name. <laughs> I've been practicing my bougie dog. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. And a three in one wireless charging station for your Apple products. <laughs> Yeah, this one I think's made out of metal or aluminum or something, and it sets all three. It just looks fancy. So. Mainly for Apple devices, my bad. <laughs> yeah. Mainly. Yeah, it'll technically charge, I think, any uh, headphones and probably any wireless phone, just not, not any watch, watch, probably. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this one says metal silver. Yeah. Okay. Very cool. Um, well, since you Still don't three, want these, I feel a little guilty about these. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so if you saw my post, um, I uh, dropped my phone and the screen quit working. So the day that happened, I said, well, I got to go to Verizon and buy a Pixel 8 Pro, even though I wanted to wait on the Pixel 9. But then it just started working randomly. Unfortunately, I had already reached out to my friends at Subcase and asked them if they could send me Pixel 8 cases because I'd need a case for my phone that I was going to buy later that day, which was before it started magically working again. So, they were nice enough to send me, uh, I think this one's upside down, three Pixel 8 Pro cases for my Blazon because I was originally going to buy the phone, but then it literally just, the screen like went back to working. I don't, I didn't do anything. It sat here all day and I picked it up and it worked. But. So, yeah. I feel if you were to accidentally drop your phone again, that's true. You'll be there. That's when does true. the new one come out? You said October. Yeah, yeah. So if you yeah. drop it before October, <laughs> that's true. That's very true. So I'm still gonna make videos for them. I unfortunately won't have a phone to put in the cases, but they'll be on Amazon. They'll go on our second YouTube. Hopefully that'll help them out some with the sales. And um, then when the nine comes out. I'll definitely be buying that and they can give me cases for that and I'll have an actual phone to make the videos with. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oopsie. Guess I'll go with this difficult daddy. You don't want the easier box? I figured you wanted that. Well, that's going to leave you with this one and you didn't want this one. I don't. So. I don't know technically. So if you did the box. Oh, I know. <laughs> then I could do that one and then that leaves that one. Well, either way, I'd do both of them. I guess me, so. me, me, me. <laughs> Natural done. Pull <Funny> card. <gasps> Say something funny, but it didn't come to me quickly. <laughs> Losing my marbles. All right, that should get you through it. You killed it. Thanks, honey buns. <laughs> no idea what this is. Oh, I think I might know. This. <gasps> Just kidding. I don't. Hold on. Model lot number network camera. It says. Oh, okay. So it's not what I thought it was. That's all I got. Yeah. Oh. So it is a camera. Now I gotta look at it. Tax right. video. Yeah, it's just a camera. Is it? Okay, well, I thought this was, there was this Bluetooth speaker I was supposed to get that had like LED words mm -hmm. on it. And I thought it would be like in the same kind of box, but uh, camera. yeah, a new networking camera, the NC500. I can't remember which camera this is and there's no picture, but a new camera. We got two new cameras today. And so this, uh, you know, relates back to this story. Uh, iBlazon and Subcase are like the same company. Well, they're not the same. They're sister companies, essentially. And so when I reached out, I asked for a Subcase Unicorn Beetle Pro, which only comes in black. 
and they were nice enough to send these because they were in colors. So this is the one that I would end up actually putting on my Pixel 6, my Pixel 8 Pro uh, if I drop my phone again and have to buy one. Subcase Unicorn Beetle Pro Pixel 8 uh, Pro phone case. These are essentially otter boxes that don't cost you $100. Yeah. Yeah, they're great. Love them. Absolutely love them. All right, last one. You want me to cut it? Yeah. So, anti-blue light screen protector. That's exactly what that is. There's nothing else to really say. It stops oh, the blue light. Computer screen? Yeah, yeah. I guess so. So it stops the blue light from, uh, which is, you know, they say it's bad for your eyes now. UV light. And uh, yeah, it basically goes over your screen, blocks the blue light, and it's better for your eyes when you're on the computer. Oh, so. it's good for your eyes and skin. Yeah, I, don't, I didn't know about skin, but hey. And I only have 27-inch monitors, so that's why I asked for the 27-inch one, which is why I was in such a massive block. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Oof. There we go. All right. That's a big day. It is. So let's uh, line up all this stuff up on the table. All right. So this is everything for Mel Monday's episode 114. And a couple of these will definitely make their way to this main YouTube channel. Definitely the cameras in the Wavelink, uh, probably in the file box. I think everything else will just be uh, on our Sega YouTube as well as our Amazon channel. These might make it to the main one if they're solar. I really can't remember them. <laughs> but that's it for Mel Mondays. We will see you in the next one. Click like. Click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. And thank you all for watching. See you next time. Deuces. Bye.